Hi everyone, it's me again. Today we're going to be making a new scratch project. Today we're going to be making a drawing game. I'm sure you've all downloaded uh, apps from the internet to draw and make your own drawing on the internet. Well, we're going to be making the same thing, but better. We're going to be using a scratch project to make that. So it, it looks exactly it is exactly what it looks like. So I'm going to show you how it works. When I click the green flag, I'm going to start. I like red, so I'm going to take red. Now I let's, well, I've drawn that. Now let's take yellow. Now green. And last of all, blue. So this actually works. Now I'm going to show you. Does the eraser work? Does it? Well, it works. Now let's clear it. So everything works. Is It's exactly how it looks like. So let's start by getting a new file. Okay, so now I've got a new file. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go and click on this to choose a sprite from a library. I'm going to go down and take this pencil. And I'm going to press OK. We're going to decrease the size of this a bit. So we're going to go and click on this, which is shrink. And we're going to shrink it. That's good enough. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go back and we're going to paint a new sprite. This sprite is going to be the color. What we're going to do first is we're going to make the sprite of red, the red sprite. So I'm going to click on this. I'm going to click on the rectangle, press shift, and make a square. You don't really need to make, be focused on making the square. If you're pressing the shift button, thus a square will be formed automatically. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go click on this fill with color. And we're going to use red. Now that is our red sprite. What we're going to do is we're going to make uh, we're going to make 3 of these but of different colors. Yellow, green and blue. Okay, so I've done mine. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go and create a new sprite. We're going to click on rectangle, but we're not going to click shift. Now we're going to make a little rectangle. But before that, let's make a text box. In that text box, we'll write click to clear. You can change the color if you want. Like, I think I'm going to take, um, I'll think, I think I'll take purple. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to re uh, rectangle. And I'm going to make a rectangle on top of this. And I'm going to make it with a color. I'm going to fill it with a color. I think I'm going to fill it with what looks good with purp, uh, maroon. I think this will look good. Undo that. Undo that. Okay, so well, we've done that. Now we're going to make another sprite. This is the last one, I promise you. We're going to make a text box first. And in it, we're going to write eraser. I think I'm going to change the color. It can be, I'm going to use the same colors. Now I'm going to take a rectangle and make it. And I think I'm gonna go back. 
rid of that. There. Oh, let's undo that. Right, now let's rearrange this in a good order. First, I want to put my click to clear over here. No, then I won't be able to draw nicely. So I'll put the eraser and click to clear over here. Then I'll put my four colors over here. There. So now that we've done that, let's go on to the scripts. First, let's make the script of the eraser. So what we're going to do that, we're going to go to events. And when this sprite clicked, then broadcast message one. But instead of message one, we're going to make it new message eraser. And hit OK. Now let's make the script of the red color. When I receive no, no. When this sprite clicked, broadcast eraser, but instead of eraser, we're going to make a new message. It's going to be called red. Now, let's make the script of the yellow one. When this sprite clicked, broadcast eraser, but instead of eraser, we're going to make a new message. It's going to be called yellow and hit OK. Now let's make the script of the blue one. When this sprite clicked, broadcast eraser, but instead of eraser, we're going to make a new message. It's going to be called blue. Now let's make the script of the green one. When this script, when the sprite clicked, Broadcast blue, but instead of blue, we're going to make a new message. It's going to be called green. And hit OK. Now, let's make this the script of the eraser. I mean, the clear button. When this sprite clicked, then go to pen and press clear. Well, that was easy. Now we're going to make the script of the pencil. First of all, we're going to go to events. Take when green flag clicked. Then we're going to go to pen and take pen up. Then we're going to go to looks and take switch costume to pencil A. Now, we're going to go to pen again and take clear. Now, we're going to take set pen size to 1, but instead of 1, we're going to change it to 4. Now, we're going to take a forever block from the control section. Now, we're going to go and take an if-then-else block. We're going to go to operators, take if dash and dash. Then, what we're going to do is that we're going to, we're going to take another if dash and dash. Take another one of those. Then, what we're going to do is we're going to go and take this block and put it over here. We're going to go to sensing and take mouse Y and put it right there. Then over here, 
we're going to write minus 147. Make sure you put the minus over there. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go to operators and take this block and put it right here. We're going to go to sensing and take mouse Y and put it here. Then over here, we're going to write 137. Over here now, what we're going to do is we're going to go back to operators, take this block, put it right here, and we're going to go to sensing and take mouse X. Make sure you know which ones you're using. If you accidentally put mouse X here, things might get a little confusing. Now over here, we're going to write minus 196. Make sure you put the negatives here. Now over here, what we're going to do is we're going to take, go to, is we're going to go to operators and take this block and put it here. Yep, now I've got that in there. We're going to go and take, go to sensing and take a mouse to X and put it right here. Then over here, we're going to write 137. So that's how our script's gonna look. Till now, we have more. We're going to go to looks. Sorry, we're going to go to motion, and we're going to go and pick up, go to mouse pointer. Now we're going to go to pen and put pen down. Else, we're going to put pen up. Now there's even more. What we're going to do now, we're going to go to events and take when I receive blue, but instead of blue, we're going to make it red. When I receive red, go to pen and set pen color to this, but instead of this, we're going to put red. Now we're going to go to events and put when I receive blue. But instead of blue, we're going to put green. Go to pen and set pen color to dash. But instead of that, we're going to make it green. Now I'm going to go to events. Take when I receive blue. I'm going to go to pen and we're going to uh, put set pen color to dash but instead of that we're going to put this color now what we're going to do is we're going to go to events and take one i receive blue but instead of blue we're going to make it yellow over here we're going to go to pen and set pen color to this but instead of this we're gonna make it yellow now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to events when I receive blue but instead of that when I receive eraser Let's go to pen and set change pen size to one but instead of one we're gonna make it ten then we're also going to put set pen color to that, but instead of that, we're going to make it white. Okay, so that's how it goes. Okay, 
Now let's go and check how it works. Let's go to full screen and click the green flag. Now let's choose green. Now, I'm satisfied with green. Let's take red. Let's make this a whole colorful page. Now, the last color, blue. Now let's use the eraser and see how it works. Okay, here's a tip. Here's our secret. When we're using a razor, look at what we did. Let's look at the script of a razor. I set pen size to 10, but I set pen color to white, and it has a white background, so it won't show. So that's my secret. Please don't share this with anyone. I'm trying to keep it a secret, you see. Okay, now let's see if click to clear works. Okay, so it works. Okay, so thank you for watching this video. And be sure to like down below. Then, don't forget to click the like button, press the subscribe button, and never, absolutely never forget to hit the bell to get all of our latest notifications. Bye-bye.